I'm Meredith. I'm Andrea. I'm TQ. And we live in Brussels, not terribly far from Molenbeek, which, if you live in the U.S., you've probably been hearing a bunch of terrifying headlines about lately. I've been getting a lot of emails and messages from uh, friends of mine in the States, you know, asking me, are you okay? Is it chaos there? What's going on? And coincidentally, we just need, we needed to go to Molenbeek tonight anyway, so we decided we'd take a video camera along and show you what it's really like. So, let's go to Molenbeek. All right, we're recording. So we are now entering the no-go zone, is that it? Thanks for those of you no-go zone. This is, should I say, come on, the start of Well, we might get murdered by the weather. <laughs> Fill the street for the death zone and the zone of no return. All the zones of the galaxy of terror. And I really hope I'm not the only person here who gets Futurama references. <laughs> So, am I hearing this right? Are you claiming that the cars all act as independent chariot judges? Damn it, should have said neighborhood of terror. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
So would you say you're being terrorized by the weather? <laughs> Not so much me as my poor umbrella. <laughs> yeah, it's not really raining so much anymore. It's problematic signage of terror. <laughs> <laughs> I am surprisingly not terrified. <laughs> Actually, it gets worse than that. Well, that was really windy. But apart from that, just a regular ordinary neighborhood. Unfortunately, the video cut out due to a uh, lack of storage space before we actually got up to the door of the hacker space where there were a bunch of kids loitering who you can just barely see at the end of the video there. Yeah. I kissed Andrea in front of the elevator, and the kids clapped and cheered, and then helped us with the elevator. I mean, these are ordinary people living ordinary lives with their ordinary neighbors. This is not, this is, this is not crazy terrorist society. So I hope you've enjoyed this little glimpse of Belgium. Um, maybe I'll show you more of my neighborhood uh, sometime in the future. But uh, for the time being, just don't worry about us. We're fine. <laughs>